And hi there, everybody. I'm meteorologist Don Morelli with you on this Monday night into our Tuesday morning. Your forecast, of course, here on iFiber Channel 1 News Weather is brought to you by Bud Cleary Toyota dealers. Toyota, let's go places. And of course, it's a rather tranquil time frame for the next couple of days, sunny days ahead. The big thing is that the temperatures are still going to be way above normal for the time being, and it'll be a little breezy at times. And all in all, nothing really going on to watch anytime soon. Maybe by the weekend, a cold front coming on right now. The models are not showing it. It just said it shows signs of a little bit of a change by Sunday, Monday. Uh, so I have the forecast pretty much the same through the next seven days, but I'm putting that little caveat in there, as weathermen always do. Something might change on Sunday. 86 and 58, the extremes today, which of course is above the normals of 77 and 51. Records 99 and 38. So again, a little bit on the toasty side out there. 86 and 53, the extremes in Moses Lake, a little closer to the normal overnight low at least, but still well above the daytime high. And 96 again was the record. Currently outside, a nice evening taking shape. 86 degrees, 42 degree dew point, 25% relative humidity. The breeze not too bad now, but occasionally gusty at times today. And I think more so the next couple of afternoons particularly in the afternoon, evening hours, uh, the best chance for a gusty breeze or two. Taking a look at the forecast for clouds and precipitation, most of the afternoon heating working in the mountains, of course, and that's where most of the showers are, but overnight they fall apart. And you see not much going on. You see a little system coming out of British Columbia that scoots across northeastern sections of the inland northwest. But after that, looking very, very quiet, at least through midweek. So really very tranquil weather taking shape. So let's take a quick look at the forecast for the state, why don't we? And again, looking very nice even across the Cascades into the Puget Sound area, the lower 60s along the court, Port Angeles around 61 degrees, but generally the 70 degree mark for the daytime high. Inland Northwest right around that 80 degree mark, upper 70s, lower 80s. And of course here in the Columbia Basin, we're getting even toastier with temperatures into the mid 80s with plenty of sunshine. You can see a very pleasant afternoon on tap, but I I think the winds will be a little stronger, maybe 20, 25 miles an hour at times from the northwest. Looking at the breeze to be occasionally gusty the next couple of days, maybe a few passing clouds at times. And again, Sunday, there are signs of a cold front coming, so we'll have to watch it. Right now we're going for the mid 80s, and really mid 80s pretty much the whole time, except for Thursday, a little dip in the thermometer, but all in all, who's complaining? Don't complain about sports because it's coming up right after this, so stay with us.